Hello dear colleagues and my dear friends this is Dr Simanchal Goel and today in this important video i am going to demonstrate you the differences between femto laser assisted cataract surgery and manual cataract surgery so i am starting this video with an article that i found online that shows the of lobbies and the opinions for and against flax versus manual cataract surgery as you can see flax has its advantages but there are some surgeons that show that say that flax is equivocal in the response the patient gets and the results the patients get if you go into detail there are several dis disadvantages of flax as well as you can just pause this video and read this article now i'll be starting a white cataract case and tell you what the major differences are so as you can see i am i have a white cataract in front of me and why is flax a famous technique and is it worth it to spend upwards of 1 lakh rupees in india for getting femto laser assisted cataract surgery or a manual cataract surgery is as good as flax so if i tell you honestly if i tell you my opinion at just the beginning of the surgery i would say both of them have their own places but we as learners we as ophthalmic surgeons must try to reproduce the results that flax offers that is the best possible incisions the best possible capsular excess and brilliant vertical chops these three steps are the ones that flax masters and if you can reproduce these three steps in a beautiful fashion you are a surgeon as good as a femto laser starting with the case i have made two side ports and i have started a decently sized rexes i would say it is not a, a big rexes but it is adequately sized it is 4 to 4.5 mm it would have been a little bigger i would have been more comfortable if it would have been in the range of 5 uh, mm considering the hardness of the cataract but nevertheless it's a good sized rexis as you can see i have made a biplanar main port it is very important if you are competing with flax you need to master these incisions and the capsular rexis in my next videos i am going to put and upload two very important videos first one being the uh, the manual how to create ideal side port and ideal main port what should be the tunnel length where should it be located and all the specifics and in the second video i am going to give you some literature on rexes and i'll demonstrate you how to use shearing and tearing forces optimally to create those beautiful looking circular rexes that compete with a femto laser once you dilate a patient and make them sit on a slit lamp the observing surgeon should should just clap for the operating surgeon seeing the rexes that should be the brilliance you should strive for that's what i have believed in going ahead with the case i have i am starting with vertical chops and here you go chop i have created a good chop who says we cannot we need catalyst or a lens x system if you are a pro at vertical chopping you go deep inside the belly of the nucleus phaco pedal 3 to phaco pedal 2 and put your chopper and chop 
once again i have created three pieces i'm using minimal phaco energy around 30 to 40 percent in pulse mode and here you go once again chop by now i have made around four pieces i can make even more pieces i think i will and here you go the fifth piece and what i need to do right now is just take one piece out and make that space in the back so that the following pieces come through in my phaco tip once again if i have to tell you flax versus manual cataract surgery flax has its importance especially in premium cases and especially if you ask me one case where i think flax dominates manual surgery is for implantation of toric lenses because centration of toric lens is very important and flax is a master in creating those perfectly circular texts both the lobbies fight over each other some surgeons and some ophthalmologists believe that manual sic is sorry manual phaco is much better than flax but i think for those brown hard cataracts lensex um, performs and does a beautiful job in decreasing that cumulative dissipated energy inside the ac and for torix femto assisted capsular axis is the way to go for all the rest cases i believe a brilliant surgeon can surpass any machine there are marginal benefits of flax over manual the gold standard will always remain manual for me needless to say my job and my channel's job is to teach you all how to strive for results that flax offers how to be that one brilliant surgeon that other surgeons are inspired by one should always make a rexis that is beautifully centered that is completely circular you use optimal amounts of shearing forces and tearing forces and those biplanar beautiful biplanar incisions or triplanar incisions those perfect side ports in the perfect plane and yes at the end a beautiful centration of the iul just coming to the end of this case i have implanted a monofocal iul in this tough white cataract this was a diabetic patient who never bothered to control his diabetes and just came in to me with this white cataract that was that had a that had a that had a uncommon consistency of the cortex as you can see in the initial steps and that's all the case is done once again if you ask me flax versus manual it is always manual phaco for me i'll be posting two videos next week for showing you how you can be the next brilliant surgeon so that no one is able to distinguish between your rexes and the one that a flax makes that's all from my side i hope you like my videos kindly like share and subscribe my channel because i have found a lot of viewers of my channel are not subscribed to my channel so i would request all of you to like share and subscribe my channel that's all from my side thank you so much and have a great day ahead